Now to an alligator attack on Hilton Head Island. Medics rushing a woman to the hospital. Our Brooke Butler is live tonight with what happened. Brooke. Dale, the attack happened in Hilton Head Plantation. Behind me, an eight-foot-long alligator latched onto a woman's legs this morning, and the attack has left neighbors shaken up. And when I heard this, it, it, it hit home because I know exactly where it happened. At around 8 Thursday morning, Hilton Head Island Town leaders say an alligator attacked a woman while she walked her dog by a lagoon near Rookery Way in Hilton Head Plantation. This is the same area longtime resident Neil Warner walks his dog. We are not going there anymore with Layla. Warner says he has seen alligators in the area before, but they never bothered anyone. I'd see them pop into the water. They would never, ever ever linger for us. Fortunately for the woman who was attacked, neighbors saw what was happening and charged into the water to save her. Pulled her out, in fact, and kind of kept an eye on the animal until the, I think the POA staff got there first. Island officials say the alligator has since been removed from the area and will be euthanized. But Warner says he's still feeling uneasy about the whole thing and is going to avoid the area where the attack happened as a result. I can assure you that uh, either I don't go there anymore or my wife will change the locks on the door. So um, she's just had made it clear we don't take Layla there anymore. So, yeah. yeah. And Dale, you may remember there have also been attacks in Sea Pines and Sun City as well. Both of those attacks also involve someone walking their dog. Back to you. Yes, I recall those. Brooke, do we know if the woman's dog was injured at all? Dale, a city of, or excuse me, Hilton Head officials tell me that the dog was fortunately not injured in this incident. Back to you. Hey, Brooke, thank you.